Hi there, this is Chris from Paracord Planet. Today we're going to revisit a bracelet that we've made in the past. Uh, this is the Extreme Weave bracelet, but I'm going to put a twist on it and make it into a United States flag for the 4th of July, right? Perfect. So what you're going to need is three colors. Blue, red, and white. Each one I have is six feet in length. I have melted the red and white together, nice and strong. Uh, I'm using a blue that has a glow tracer in it, which uh, should turn out to be pretty decent. I have a 5 8 inch buckle. I have a fid. fid. I have a lighter that I wrapped in paracord. And I have a scissor. So a uh, ruler would also be handy. So let's get uh, together. So bracelet, extreme weave, American flag, go. So what we're going to do is loop this a little bit, going to flatten it out. We're going to stick this through the top of the buckle and we are going to pull this through to the top. We are going to pull that over. We are going to get this done right here. So it's like that. And then we are going to pull this all the way down, keeping the sides together. And then Take our buckle through the bottom and pull it straight through till you get the size that you want. And then now we're going to take the white color and we are going to push it to the bottom. All the way again, off to one side, pull it through, so it makes a nice little loop for you, just like that. And we're going to do the same to the red, we're going to have to push this off to the side a little bit to get it to go through. And we are going to push that through. So now you've got a double loop. See that part of it? Okay, we'll take that apart. Got those two together. I'm going to take my ruler. I'm going to measure to see how big we're going to make this one, about eight and a half inches, which is what I'm going to be looking for. And now, um, the other side, I'm going to do the same thing. We're going to push this in through the top. So the red is going on the red side, the white on the white, and we will pull that all the way through. Don't pull it too tight, they all should be the same length, you don't want to change the bracelet size. So we'll do the same with the white. We'll go in through the top, and we will go from that to this. So there we go. See the four. Uh, I always like to measure it again just to make sure I haven't moved anything. Um, it's happened for me <laughs> before in the past and I've gotten some pretty long bracelets out of it by accident. So there you go. Everything is where it should be. side, white on the left. So, so once you got this part of it, you are going to take this red one on the right side, you're going to put it under and across itself on the right, so it looks kind of like that. You're going to take this white one, you're going to go over itself on the left, under the middle, and over on the left or I'm sorry, on the right, and you're going to get something that looks just like that. Can you see that? Okay, so the next part is you go under both of these. Now you go under the white one and you go under the red one. So you go under both of those. You're going to go over the center and under the left 
and you're going to do the opposite coming back and you're going to go over under and over the red on the right and you push it up a little bit get that all nice and tight doesn't need to be super tight but it helps to be consistent okay and there we are so far now we are going to do the same thing with the white. So it's going to go under this red, those two, over, under, pull through, move it up a little bit, turn it around, it's going to go over, under, and over, and pull it across, slide it up. Pull it a little tight, doesn't have to be again super tight, but just so it's symmetrical. And there you have the start of the flag. So we just keep going. Right hand side, wrap it under, over, under, pull it through. And then we're going to go turn it around, go over, under, over. Pull it through, slide those up, pull it tight ish again. See, it's turning perfect. And you just keep going. I'm gonna do one more and then I'm gonna take a break. I'm gonna move this, uh, finish this all up to where we want to switch colors and then we'll go from there. There we go. So we got that on the back side. We got this on the front, so now it's time to put our blue on here. And what we're going to do is find the center of this blue. We are going to put the blue just over the center. So basically it's just going to look like that. Right through. This right side, we're going to loop it around once, around this right hand side so it kind of looks like a twist like that see it okay this side we're going to continue with over under the center and over the right hand side so you're going to get something that looks a little like that now this one since you've already gone over is underneath this one so we're just going to follow it over the center, under the left, pull through, over the left, under the center, over the right, push it up, pull it tight. It's important to get this first one right here tight um, because it's not really connected like the other ones are, you have to pull out just a little bit more to get it to look right. So there you go. That's what we got to start with. So now you continue it just like you did with the bracelet. So this one goes under the right, over the left, or the center, under the left, pull it through. It's over the left, under the center, over the right. Tighten it up, push everything towards the top, make it uniform, and there's the start of our blues. So this side again, right underneath, over the center, under the left, over the left, under the center, over the right. Push it up. Situated there, and you just keep going. As you can tell, 
So it's getting a little harder to get it through that bottom set. So the last one uh, I'm actually going to use a fit on. Pull through. And there you have it. Now with the fit still on this one, we'll flip it around. And I will poke it through the last two. And I will put the fit on the other side. And I will poke it through the same ones. So now just for these all you need to do is cut them. Melt them. Push them flat. And the same with the blue. And there is your 4th of July Extreme Weave Bracelet. Happy 4th of July, everybody.